Happy spring at our own students and staff. This is Nyla here for another edition of WRSN. Believe it or not, the first day of spring was last week on March 20th. Even though it may not feel like it, warmer days are coming. First off in the news for the week of March 24th, 2014, just a reminder that the new Smarter Balance Assessment has started for grades 3 and 4. It's always important to be curious of the learning going on in the classrooms. Remember to walk quietly as you're passing through the hallways. Also important is remembering a good night's sleep and eating a healthy breakfast in the morning to ensure that all Reynolds students are ready for the day. That's a great point, Katie. Also in the news, students' learning conferences will be held this week at Anna Reynolds. There will be early release on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Dismissal will be at 1.35 and lunch will be served. Speaking of lunch, Lunch Pals for Grade 4 will be meeting with Dr. Rizone today. Students are nominated by their teachers for being bucket fillers or contributing links to our chain of kindness. Uh, hey, Katie, have you ever noticed the award medals in some of the picture books in the library? If you look closely, you may see the name Caldecott in some of them. That means the book was recognized for being the most distinguished picture book of the year. Actually, I have noticed those medals. As a matter of fact, I learned that that award was named after a man, Randolph Caldecott, who was an illustrator of children's books in the late 1800s. His birthday was in the week of March 22, 1846. Here's a brief montage about that award. Hi, we are here to tell you about the Caldecott Book Award. The award started in 1938. Each year, a group of librarians choose the greatest American picture book. The books they choose have to be appropriate for a child audience. The first book they chose was a picture book called Animals of the Bible. If you want to check out any of these books, check, check out, out your local library. library. This medal winner went to a book called Locomotive, written and illustrated by Brian Flacca. Other honors include Journey by Aaron Becker, Flora and the Flamingo by Mo Molly Idol, and Mr. Waffles by David Weiners. Check out Media Center and your classroom libraries for the past Caldecott Award winners. Last up in the news, there will be a Mother-Son Sports Night this Friday. The event is sponsored by the Anna Reynolds PTO and will run from 5 o'clock to 8.30. And with that, that's going to be for the week, this week's show. Have, Have a, a great week, week everyone. And, and remember, remember to follow the ABCs of Reynolds, Reynolds Respect. Respect. A's for always do your best. D is for be respectful and be safe. C is care for yourself and others. Bye.